Hi everybody, do a quick unboxing of the Gigabyte GeForce GTX 1660 Gaming OC. It has 6 gigabytes of RAM. It's a stripped down version of the 1660 Ti. It has 8% less shaders, about 33% less memory bandwidth, so it's a uh, like 10 or 15% faster than a GTX 1060 and it's pretty much positioned as a energy efficient RX 590. By the way, I found it odd that Gigabyte has waited for the launch of their RX 590 cards until this one gets released. It was kind of odd, but who knows what the politics are there. So let's have a look. I guess this card has been reviewed for plenty of times, so not really a lot to talk about. But I like those unboxings, so I just do it. So, the first thing <laughs> I have to say is that despite the card being a uh, I think, where, despite the card having a TDP of or a power usage of about about uh, 120 watts, the cooling is pretty similar the um, with the ones of the Radeon 7, which just make me think why AMD, why the hell did they put such a loud shitty cooler on their cards always? But whatever. So, the build has a cheap feeling, but it's a more or less a budget card, so can not really complain. And actually, I don't really care about ca how card looks, so as long they are not too loud. And so, you have an 8-pin pin power connector, so I think it can pull around, 20, around 200 watts, but as I said, 120 watts is the power it normally uses by specification so you can overclock it a bit yeah i'm pretty sure the gtx 1660 will sell like hotcakes as always and uh, amd is uh, in a pretty bad place at the moment i would say and uh, we will see how it all turns out when navi has been released in summer, around summer. So, yeah, that's it.